So we've been having a ton of fun this afternoon. If you want to continue that trend into the weekend, you're going to have to stop by the Roland E. Powell Convention Center in Ocean City for the 48th annual Ward World Championship Wild Fowl. I didn't get all that in there, right? <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, it's a wild fowl carving competition and art festival, and some of the world's best carvers and most enthusiastic collectors will be there. Delmarva Life Sydney Whitfield's also there to show us just a little snippet of the fun you can expect. Sid? Yeah, right now I'm at the 2018 Ward World Competition, surrounded by artists from all over the world. And here to tell me more about it is Executive Director Laura Bottinelli. Laura, thanks for being with me today. Thanks for coming over. Absolutely. In 48 years of this competition, can you tell me a little bit about how you guys came about? Well, so the Ward Foundation um, has been running this event to celebrate wildfowl carving for decades. Right. Um, we honor Lemon Steve Ward, who is whom we're named for, and artists from around the world come together to compete. But it started out much smaller than that. Uh, people were carving decoys and seeing who could carve the best one, and over time it grew into this amazing showcase of artwork of all different types of nature and the outdoors. Right, and I can tell it is amazing. And you, this is also the 50th anniversary of the Ward Foundation, too, correct? correct? Yeah, so those folks who know the work of the Ward Foundation, you probably are familiar with our museum headquarters in Salisbury. Um, but for 50 years we've been working and celebrating art, nature, and tradition and uh, preserving the legacy of Lemon Steve Ward. Um, it's a really big deal for us to, to meet 50. Um, there's been people who have contributed all over those years and this event, this World Championship, is our signature event. It's, it's the reason the organization has sustained itself for 50 years. Wow, and that's a long time. Mm -hmm. And the contributors are also from all over the world, right? Yes, yeah. So our artists um, come from a, a, around the globe to compete at this event. And we regularly have competitors um, from Japan and Canada and Scotland and Barbados and Trinidad and Puerto Rico and on and on and on. Um, we have uh, artists from the Netherlands. Um, the beautiful sculpture behind me is by an artist from Russia. Um, and this is a prestigious international event, the top prize in the field of wildfowl carving. And it's really spectacular. If anything, when you come here, you will be amazed at the work that these uh, artists are able to produce. Yeah, and in addition to the competition, there's also going to be some carving demos, correct? Correct, yeah. We have uh, uh, artists who are demonstrating um, carving, uh, including hatchet carving, which is sort of a traditional way to uh, chop out a decoy. Um, we have other types of carving demos so you can get a sense of how things are made. Um, there's uh, different workshops that are going on for artists who want to get, um, have like sort of like some how-tos from professional artists. And quite honestly, just walking around this room, it's not uncommon that you just strike an artist uh, conversation up with an artist who's looking at their work or someone else's work. It's a very accessible event for people to come and get close to this amazing art. I like that. Yeah. And, and you've been doing this for a couple of years now. Yeah. Yeah. What's your favorite part? What do you feel like is the draw to the competition? Um, so the camaraderie of the community of artists is really what has kept this going and the excellence of their art. You know, I think I love the relationships that have been built over the years and so we have a number of people who live on the Eastern Shore that volunteer here and come out to support the event because they are part of the community. And it's brought me in and it's brought in thousands of others and whether you're a volunteer or an artist or a visitor, there's something for you. Um, so these relationships, some of them are 50 years deep and some of them are one year old and you can come and be a part of it. Oh, perfect. Sounds like a great weekend yeah. coming up. Thank you so much, Thanks Laura. for coming. Absolutely. And remember, the competition is going to be going on through this weekend. If you want more information on tickets and entry, go to our website, delmarvalife.com.